Hello everyone, today we will go through all the settings of the Readabler to show you all the customization options. Right after the plugin is installed and activated, the accessibility button is already displayed on all pages of your site. Now you can go to the settings and adapt them to your needs and wishes. On the general tab, you can find many switches that will allow you to enable, disable certain modes or options in the accessibility window that your visitors can use. For example, now we disable epilepsy safe mode and visually impaired mode and can see the result in the accessibility window. Moving to the open button tab, here you can enable or disable the display of the accessibility button or customize the styles of this button. The style settings are quite flexible and clear. You can manage the display of button position, change the icon, colors and other things. When you disable the button, you can add an accessibility window anywhere on the site using a button, menu item, or link with a special class. You can find more information about this in our documentation. All window settings manage the accessibility window display styles. You can control the position, colors for light and dark themes, and change appearance and behavior. The Design and Behavior tab includes style settings for certain options in the accessibility windows. For example, let's change the color of the Highlight Titles option. Here is the current color, now change the color to another and see the result. You can style other options in the same way. Besides, if you have changed the language of your site or you have a multilingual site, then in the virtual keyboard layout you can select the necessary languages and they will be applied depending on the language of the current page. Go to the Accessibility Statement Settings. Here you can change the text of the statement and also select the source. By default, the generated by plugin source is set where you can enter your data and it will be automatically inserted into the text. You can also select custom link source or none line. If you select none, then the accessibility statement link will be disabled. The section with hot keys setting for quick interaction with the site. The plugin provides default settings but they can be easily changed according to your wishes. The voice navigation settings allow users navigating the site using voice commands. The tab offers to set commands for each of the actions on the site or disable some of them. You can find more information about some options in our documentation in the video description. The Accessibility Analyzer Settings tab allows you to check your website pages and posts, including custom post types and find accessibility issues, which you can fix. You can run page analysis in different places. As an example, I'll show you how this can be done on the post list page. Go to the list of posts and click the Analyze button. You can view detected problems by visiting the page. These problems are displayed only for the admin and visitors do not see this. Here you can find details about each problem so you can understand how to fix it. The Readabler plugin does not fix problems, but only detects them according to the rules. A usage analytics section allow to enable and configuring analytics on the use of the accessibility window. It collects anonymous information about the usage of Readabler by your visitors. The Send Interval option adjusts the interval of sending data to the server. The larger the interval, the smaller the number of requests to the server. These switches control the display of statistics in different places. It can be displayed in the Dashboard widget. Post Meta Box Or on the Post List page. Also, all analytics can be cleared you. The initial accessibility settings allow you to automatically enable certain options, mode in the accessibility window before the user start configure them according to the personal requirements. For example, we can select epilepsy safe mode mode and readable font. Also, enable the ignore user config option. In this case, after the page loads, the selected modes will be enabled. The Assignment Settings tab included in many of our plugins where you can apply a plugin on certain pages or under certain conditions. By default, the Accessibility button is displayed throughout the site and you can exclude it for certain pages. 
menu items, languages, user roles or for other conditions. If you need to enable the readable or only on certain pages, then it is better to use the include option. In this case the button will be displayed only under the specified conditions. You should be careful when applying more than one rule, and also take into account the matching method so as not to hide the button for all pages of the site. Finally, we saw the main Readabler settings and I hope this helped you learn more about the capabilities of the plugin. Thank you for your attention.